Imposter syndrome is something that's not very fun. So it's feeling like you're not worthy of whatever role or position you're in. And defeating this imposter syndrome can be a challenge, but the best way that I've found is literally more work output. So literally work more, provide more work output. This will prove first to yourself that you're worthy. And then if there's people around you who are being naysayers and saying, how did this person get this job? This person isn't worthy of this job. If you can provide consistent work output, they can't say that for very long. So providing that work output is a very easy way for you to kill the imposter syndrome in yourself first, and then the naysayers around you. So let the work output speak for itself. That should kill your imposter syndrome. And if you have further problems past imposter syndrome, you need to start having some more self-awareness. So work on your emotional intelligence or EQ here and really try to figure out what's holding you back. So shadow work, maybe something like hypnosis, really get into deep in your psyche and figure out if there's something holding you back at a core level that's causing you to have this imposter syndrome and not feeling good enough. But until then, you should just produce more positive work output and take credit for it. In taking credit for it, you're gonna be able to kill that imposter syndrome and progress with your career. I trust you've been paying attention to this video thus far. I want to help you pay even better attention to your emotional and social intelligence by clicking the link below this video and scheduling a free call with me. On the call, we'll come up with a personalized plan for you to start getting bigger raises, faster promotions, and stronger relationships with everyone around you. Don't delay, click that link below and schedule a call with me today.